Well, hey guys, I'm Ryan Mahan here at the Hattiesburg Zoo in front of the Sumatran tiger here, whose name is? Kipling. Kipling, Kipling the tiger. And I gotta tell you, I'm a big fan of these big jungle cats, and this guy is an absolute stunner. Huge, huge majestic cat. But I'm struck by his size and his power. Like, how much does one of these guys put away? So he eats about seven to 10 pounds a day. And in the wild, they can eat up to 40 pounds a day, no problem. I could maybe do that under the right circumstances as well, but uh, but I've always had the opinion that of these big cats, like if you if you got them early enough, that they would be okay. I'm now realizing that that was 100% horribly incorrect. So right, right. what about these animals? Just absolutely massive, powerful creatures. Yes, they are. So we have Kipling here who's 15 years old. He was a Sumatran tiger, like you said. Uh, he came to us from the Dallas Zoo a couple of years ago. Uh, what's unique about these guys is they are smaller species of tiger. They're kind of on the smaller size compared to what we used to have here, which was a Siberian tiger. But what's great about these guys is they're from a really hot, humid environment naturally. So they actually do really well here in South Mississippi. I like that a lot. Uh, keeping them healthy here, trying to keep them healthy in the wild as well. Are you also trying to maybe inspire some young zoologists? Absolutely. I, I started out going to zoos all the time and anytime we have an opportunity to, to speak with little ones that have just a natural interest in animals, we take the opportunity to talk to them. We have a great volunteer program also here where people can come in, work alongside of us and see if there's something they want to do. And we hope to kind of instill and keep that next generation of zookeepers coming along because it's very important. Very nice. Uh, I'm, I'm curious as to what does it sound like when this guy really gets purring? Uh, so, so big cats don't actually purr you. It's a very interesting fact. They chuff. So it's, it's kind of a more of a breathy purr, but when he growls and roars, it is very, very, very loud, especially when he's inside his holding. Do you mind give us an, an example? I promise to do it too. A chuff? Yeah. So it's real, real kind of in the front of your mouth, you go That's it. Like a horse, That's perfect. Huh? Yeah, it's kind of like a horse. Kind of I could do that. All right. <laughs> Wild Wednesdays with Ryan Mahan, brought to you by Rainforest Car Wash and the Hattiesburg Zoo.